In this series, we are going to look at the history of some of the buildings in Church Street. This one is all about the Hill Carter. Ralph Ward Jackson is known as the man who built West Hartlepool. He was a solicitor who became involved building a new railway line named the Stockton and Hartlepool Railway. It was built to transport coal straight to the ships on the coast. Jackson became frustrated at the high fees he was being charged to use the docks, which were run by Hartlepool Dock and Railway Company. So in 1844, he sought permission from Parliament to develop a West Harbour and Coal Dock to rival that of the old town of Hartlepool. Building started in 1847 and a new town was to be built around the new dock called West Hartlepool. By 1880, the new dock was the third largest port in the country behind London and Liverpool. Central to this new town was Church Street. In 1887, a new department store with five floors opened on Church Street called Hill and Carter. Ran by Carter Company from Stockton and Dennis Hill from North Shields and Newcastle. The company had expanded from making clothes for seamen to having drapery and upholstery departments. The Hill and Carter served the West Hartlepool shoppers until 1937, when Blackards of Sunderland took over the store. Blackards sold a huge range of products, such as linens like tablecloths, clothes, jewellery, plant pots and shaving brushes, but they were mostly known for their fantastic Christmas toy fairs. Blackards closed in 1970 and the building became the Dovecot sales rooms. This was a discount store which piled stock high and sold it cheap. In 1977 you could get a Tom and Jerry compendium of games for 99 pence or a doll's house for £4.95. In 1997 the building was refurbished as a hotel and bar and opened under the name the Hill Carter Hotel, referring to the original owners of the building. The hotel had 26 bedrooms with a bar serving evening meals, two nightclubs, function suites to hire, and it was very popular, especially the rooftop restaurant with fantastic views of the town. The hotel closed in 2019 and reopened the first floor as the Hill Carter Bar in 2022. Plans are in process to develop the upper floors into student accommodation to add another chapter to the building's long history, which started with Ralph Ward Jackson. So it's time for an activity. Work in small groups. Each team must come up with their ideas and present them to the teacher who will choose one group with the best thought out plans. Congratulations team, you are the new owners of the Hill Carter building, but what are you gonna do with it? Whatever you do, you need approval from your investor, that's your teacher. So come up with an idea of how to use the building for your brand new business. There are some questions here to think about, such as who will your customers be and what services will you offer to the community? I'd love to hear some of your ideas. Good luck and may the best team win.